Hey guys, it's time to talk about the camera king, the upcoming beast of Huawei, the Huawei P30 and P30 Pro. Last time we talked about the design of the Huawei P30 Pro, but now we have a camera leaks on that. And we also have a news on the upcoming beast chipset of Huawei that will power the upcoming Huawei P series. So as you know, Huawei always use their best cameras in their pro version, while in the non-pro versions, they use their normal camera set sensors but in the Huawei P30 family things will be changed. A new report indicates that the Huawei P30 will feature three camera sensors on the back panel and according to main man Alex, in the triple rear camera setup, the main camera sensor will support a maximum resolution of 40 megapixel similar to Huawei P20 Pro and Mate 20 Pro. So you can definitely expect 48 megapixel sensor in the Pro version. And one of the sensors in the triple camera setup will have a telephoto lens enabling the device to support 5 times optical zoom. The Huawei Mate 20 Pro has 3 times optical zoom and 5 times hybrid zoom but the P30 non-pro version will have 5 times optical zoom so you can expect up to 8 times or 10 times hybrid zoom. Now instead of the monochrome sensor that Huawei usually uses in the P3 smartphone, the phone will have a newly updated wide angle sensor as you have first seen on the Huawei Mate 20 family and as for the front facing camera, according to Evelis, the smartphone will feature a 24 megapixel snapper. We are also expecting the front facing camera to support the various AI based features. Now as for the Huawei P30 Pro, we know that it will have 4 rear cameras in a vertical orientation and according to XD developers, only 3 of the 4 cameras on the Huawei P30 Pro can be used for taking pictures while the 4th one will be the time of flight sensor as I've talked about it before. The TUF sensor will be used for 3D facial unlocking improved portrait mode images and also for the AR. However, one of the Huawei P30 Pro sensor is a telephoto lens with 10 times optical zoom. Yes, 10 times optical zoom, the Huawei P30 will have a telephoto lens with 5 times optical zoom. Huawei is definitely getting crazy improvements in the camera department. Now as for the design of the piece, the Pro version will have a water drop notch on top because that phone will use OLED and whole on OLED is currently exclusive with Samsung. While there's been huge huge chances that the non-Pro version might have hole on display as that phone will have LCD panel instead of OLED. Under the hood, the Huawei P30 family will be powered by upcoming new chipset of Huawei, the Huawei Current 985. According to Michel Rahman, the editor at XT Developers, Huawei's next chipset will be called Kirin 985. Seeing the name of the processor and comparing it to the older Huawei mobile SOCs with names that ends with 5, there is a huge probability the Kirin 985 is a slightly upgraded version of the Kirin 980. Last time Huawei released a slightly upgraded version of its main chipset was in 2016 and that was the Kirin 955 which powered the Huawei P9, its predecessor the Kirin 950 was released back in 2015 and appeared in the Mate 8. The major difference between both is that the Kirin 955 is clocked at 2.5 GHz while the Kirin 950 is clocked at 2.3 GHz. Every other thing down to the GPU is the same in both processors so seems like the Huawei Kirin 985 may offer a slightly improvement over the Kirin 980 to rival the Snapdragon 855 chipset and it might also offer 5G. So yeah that's all on the Huawei P30 family let me know what you think about the crazy camera details and what you expect from the upcoming chipset of huawei and yeah see you soon